Welcome to Back to School Night 2022. This is Miss Ward coming to you from Room 101, and I wanted to introduce myself and tell you a little bit about the two classes I teach, Life Science and AVID. To get to know me, it's important for you to know that I love teaching. I've been doing this for about 15 years now, and prior to that, I was a geologist at a national environmental firm. So science has always been an important part of my life. I think it's really important for students to be able to learn the strategies they need to be successful in all classes, not just academically, but socially and emotionally as well. With that being said, I always incorporate restorative justice practices into my classroom. If you look on the left, you can see how restorative ju justice practices encompass the whole school. We work very hard within the classroom to have classroom community circles and restorative conversations, and this allows for the relationships that we foster to stay strong. AVID is a really unique opportunity because it allows students to advance via their individual determination. It's a program that can go from elementary to high school and allows students to again bring the strategies and tools that they learn in this class out into the world. This class is pass fail and it is um, in session every other day. So I either have your students on A days or I have your students on B days. We're going to be doing a lot of work on our Chromebooks. So all I ask is that our students come with a charged Chromebook. If you come over here to my life science page, you will see again that in life science, we're gonna be talking a lot about different areas of biology, such as characteristics of life, the organization of life, genetics, and how organisms interact with their environment. Life science is something that will be revisited again in ninth grade at OHS. And the AVID technologies and the restorative justice practices that I do, I also incorporate into this class. It's important to understand that we will be doing projects on a weekly basis, and each student will be required to reflect on their work for the week. The nice thing is that in both my AVID and my life science classes, I will be keeping a record of these reflections so that your student and I can meet throughout the year and see how they've learned and how they've grown. I hope that you enjoyed this little mini presentation. If you have any questions, again, please feel free to email me at eward at osningufsd.org. And remember that when our students fail, it's not the opposite of success. Failure is a part of success. Have a wonderful evening and please, I look forward to any questions or comments you may have and a wonderful school year. Thanks.